Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. I'm Shirley. And I'm Dre. And together we are Beauty and the Beer. So today we're watching Arcane. Today we're jumping back into Arcane for Season 2, Episode 4, Paint the Town Blue. Ooh. Let's get right into it. Let's do it. Going in. That was a stretch. Wow, they're riding in the name of Jinx, eh? I'll get it. Ooh. These guys ain't playing. I think they dyed all their hair blue. I don't know. Some of them they actually look dope on. Oh, that's right. She's with Ambessa now. Hey, holy jeez. Okay, that's a lookout. That's Jinx's lookout. Right, right, right. Wow. Wow. How long her braids were. Oh my god. What is it? Whoa, what was that? You see all those faces that came up behind him when he was in the hoodie just now? This guy's evolving, bro. He's evolved already, but it's continuing. Mason's Guild. Let me guess. Oh, wow. They doubled their fortification requests again to keep, keep us safe. Interesting. I never expected this to go on so long. Are you talking about your relationship or this battle? I don't know what I thought. Just it wasn't this. Dang. Besides, a withdrawal could lead to a worse situation than uh, one that Okay, I'm better. <laughs> well, you sound just like her, eh? Without her, who knows how many enforcers we'd have lost. I've learned so much from her. You're our leader. The enforcers held over. They follow you. I follow you. <laughs> You're not the redhead I wanted. I'll come to bed soon. Ladies and gentlemen, you're in the wrong place. Wow. Uh. And scallywags, put your hooks and paws together in the gray corner. Our undefeated champion with claws like that. Sharper daggers, the devilish, the wretched, the deep, with hideous mandibles and a face that would make a bro mother squirm. <laughs> are these giant or are these just insects? I'm I'm waiting to see. I think they're little tiny ones. Just hyping it up. And they painted them too. Oh. Yeah, look how small they are. Show some effort. In his eyes, she looks that grandiose, you know. Congratulations on your victory. <laughs> You're past your prime champ. The only thing to do is a rematch. Return of the Titans. <laughs> Vengeance. Redemption. No chance. She wants to become. Ta -da! Uh, wow. You like it? I had a different name back then. You know, Powder. Stupid, wow. right? I thought I was rid of her for good, but. Uh... Ooh. That's a dope handshake. Savika put you up to this. Jinx is dead. It might take some kind of heinous act on the the enforcer's behalf for Jinx just to come again. out again. Does this man have horns? Mm -hmm. Or headphones? Or horns. You guys are watching from behind protected glass with protective eyewear, and this guy's right there. The sacrifice. 
that's official line. Let's see what happens to him. Oh my goodness. He's gone. This is their doing. We can't be certain the black... Keep their name out of your mouth. We can't be certain the order was also behind the disappearance. The moment we seize control of this backwater, everyone with an inkling of talent vanishes. It's no coincidence. Our instincts were right. How could I not secure the scientists? You're the most powerful in this battle. Daughter, Rictus. She's little jinx, babe. That's where the similarities end. No body count, no theatrics. You think it's a copycat? I think we've made them desperate for something to believe in. Bars. Oh, you saw her face. Yeah. Quite the familiar face these days. Ooh. General. She picks up like on everything. everything. Hello. Private. Okay. Same. That is quite... I suppose I don't need to advise you on the hazards of professional entanglements. Ooh. Entanglements! <laughs> to provide. It's beyond question. Was it for my encouragement that your man Rictus was instigating violence? You don't trust me. The blade cuts both ways. Ooh. Right back at you. Bars. Arrest hmm? require Look how big uh, Ambassador is. is there? than returning peace to this city. Why is peace always the justification for violence? Mmm, wow. Bars in this show is crazy. You've lost so many. But you will never rest... Is she warming up the fucking thing to go hit her, babe? Or... Maybe I underestimated you. Maybe you have the strength I do not to forgive. This <laughs> guy. The most lavish gal is in the city. It was a measure of status to be on my guest list. Toast wow. of the town. <laughs> Plus, you're one of the few counselors left from the old batch, right? Never learned anything about the younger Medarda, did they? Even when she's not here, she's all anyone talks about. When you're missing this long, you're not coming back. Same time next week? Tomorrow. The effects have been diminishing. Oh. I keep hearing about this healer down in the fissures, way out on the fringes. Our boy Victor. He makes miracles happen. I saw one, like nothing I'd ever seen before. Man, not here, Dave Savika. Fat chance. About what? Your stunt at the checkpoint. No idea what you're babbling about. That wasn't you. So I'm thinking. Not your strong suit. Would make a world. Of wow. If you <laughs> wow. Your symbol. Huh. You want a symbol? Oh, mm. it's gone. I told you, I'm not interested. Do you know how much he sacrificed to protect you? He believed in your potential. Well, then he shouldn't have died. Stick your head in the dirt if you want. But this fantasy you've been living out here, it's not going to last forever. 
I gotta go bother someone. I probably owe it to you. On account of the murdering and all. But I got... On account of the murdering. <laughs> a friend. And I, I don't want to mess it up. Wow. If you care so much about me playing your stupid revolution game, speak up now. Or I guess... I guess you're... You're really gone. Died in the name of good. That's always a uh, risky business. Slippery slope. There's some fire ass candles though. Yo, that painting was amazing. Yo, and Echo's at the top. Echo, look at him, living icon. That statue is uh. crazy. That statue's crazy. Oh no, he yeah. gave it up. Yeah, statue tonight. Everybody's gathered at their own statue, their own little places of worship. Ooh. It's no secret we got history. Oop, we're close now. All sides. We gotta choose right now whether we're gonna throw in the towel or make a stand together. Not as firelights or jinxers or washed up goons. <laughs> What does that matter? You, you have to. You have to. Do you need a symbol to fight for? Actually, you probably do. But is her not showing up? Take away from that. Oh. Yep. That arm is, is what. Oh. Oh, the doc. He's gonna what unleash his uh, Yo. his werewolf thingies. You got something handy? Ooh, even one arm to be good. Wow! Mm. <coughs> oh my wow. god! Oh shit! Bruh. Uh oh. Damage has been done. <gasps> He's coming once he smells that blood. No! Babe. Babe. Bruh. Truck might be ripped in half by that thing that's coming out of. <gasps> oh my god, no. Oh my gosh. Oh. We won't be staying long. Doc knows. Oh, whoa. 
That thing is. Oh Yo, my no. gosh. Follow the blood. <sighs> it's clear as day for him. Now, if he rips up their holding facility, like, what are you going to do? What do you do? Can't even arrest people anymore. Exactly. Don't suppose you can swim, huh? Savika is jacked, boy. He's trying to play cool. Watch this guy! I thought he heard something. Ah, it's me. Who are you? <gasps> wow. Mm, jinx? <laughs> yeah, never heard that before. You're not gonna haul me in? Jinx, the master criminal, wears pants like that. What's wrong with my pants? You look like a half-eaten circus tent. <laughs> A half eaten circus tent? <coughs> I thought it was Vi for a second. Oh! That one cut deep. Half eaten. <laughs> Focus. <laughs> Yo, that and that actually makes perfect sense. Oh my. Oh, this guy. Don't you take her in? I gave her a choice between this and a swim in the harbor. Oh my gosh. Yo, she is a killer, bro. Cell block C. Carry on, officer. Yes, sir. Move it. Oh my gosh, she's getting ready. They're going down into the belly to rip it open. I gotta move on, guys. My daughter might be coming back right now. She'll kill half of y'all before y'all even know it. Oh my god. She's gonna encounter that thing first. Yep. Oh, oh my, my god. Yo, I don't know how strong. Look at that blade. Oh my god, but how big is the thing? That looked like a short story. Yeah. Oh my god, just the speed he came out at. Oh, she's pulling it the wrong way. You're late for Stink Ma's great comeuppance. <laughs> <laughs> so, that's crazy. She told her to get off before, and now she's holding her like she's really your sister. Mm. Oh my god, he's here. Your transportation. Oh my oh, god. Oh no, oh, dog. Oh my gosh. Get in a cell right now. Get in a cell right now, bruh. What is that oozing out the door? The thing dropped. Oh my gosh. Can her gun... Mm. Bro. I don't know what Hextech might be able to do against... Blue Garu. Oh, 
Run, bro. Everybody run, bro. Tickled him. It tickled him. Get around. What are you oh going to do? You really are a big fat hero. Oh! Fast because there's a shimmer now, too. Yeah, eh? pretty much. Oh, my gosh! Oh, no. Ooh. Too big, too strong, too fast. Yo. Bro, I gotta watch that back. You guys are fucking kidding me, bro. What did he create? Look at the eyes, babe. It's so young powder. And the eyes change colors. It recognized the toy. It was looking at it in her hand, and it recognized, babe. Well, I mean, it recognized her, right? Like, yeah. Yo, these guys, kind like the storytelling in this shit, bro. Like, you guys, man. Like, I thought it was so incredible how, like, because of the fact that the incidents that happened in Piltover made them come so forcefully at Zon, forcing Zon to not like forcing Zon to put aside their own personal squabbles and to unite against the common enemy. Because I mean, your squab you had a firelight squabble with Jinx or Jinx or the Jinxers or or with the old goons. That's that's one thing. But the fact that the people from Piltover are coming to wipe out your existence. Mm -hmm. Wipe out your existence. You know, you set your priorities you set your priorities to a different uh you set your lens to a different focus and you you guys unite against the common enemy. I thought that was impressive that the firelights had because of the fact that they have to make, and we know they're all about good. You know what I'm saying? So the fact that they have to join forces with who they saw as was ruining, was ruining the underground zone. They have to join forces with them just so that the underground actually survives. So there's, there's actually an underground for them to fight for in the future. There's a, a there's an underground for them to have to prosper with in the future. Like, I thought that was impressive. And then I'm like, it's a wrap because that beast is too big, too strong, too fast. And like, I don't like, yes, powder was real slick with it, with the shimmer, but the hex tech shot she was firing and off. We're not having a great effect. effect yeah. You know what I'm saying? And right that. before she's about to be eviscerated, the thing audibly says, Outer. Outer. Yeah. You guys got you guys really got something great going here, man. 
Wow. You guys really got something great going here. And the fact that the thing is not only that fast, big, strong, and fast, but it also clearly has intelligence. Because mm -hmm. the thing is, that's the thing I didn't understand. I'm like, regardless of how high or fast this thing jumps, he has to travel through land, whereas they traveled by train, you know what I'm saying, above land. So, no, it actually knew that it had it to had be to in this container. Car. Yeah, exactly. Wait, wait, wait. And it's, okay, it might stop. Let me burst out the doors, you know? And the thing is, God knows what happened to the Madara during them. Because, like... I wonder, yeah. If anything, they probably got wounds that were superficial and at least one of them survived. But I know one of the three people on that platform didn't Did make it. Did not make it. You know? That's for sure. And we didn't even get to see Mel... We didn't. First of all, we didn't get to, get to see Vi this episode... And we didn't Jeez, even see where Mel's no. being held yet. Yeah, a whole bunch of people. Yo, there. you guys got so much ammunition. You don't even need to. You guys got so much ammo. <sighs> Holy moly. That's oh, insane, I right? I wonder how, what kind of effect that had on, on Jinx. What do you mean? The, the hearing the whole powder thing? Mm -hmm. That's the thing. I mean, unless the, unless he can sit down and like uh, Beauty and the Beast and sit down and actually have a conversation, I don't know how far that'll go. You know what I'm saying? Because of the fact that the only reason that you're the only reason that that Warwick, I'm guessing Vander, was released was because of the simple fact that you had to come back out to defend the underground. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. The only reason that you're even in a position of captivity is because they're oppressing you guys to the point where you had to make an actual appearance. You know what I'm saying? Jinx is, Jinx is back. You know what I'm saying? So she, because the thing is him being, him being there only kind of fortifies the potential for her side. Because you release that thing, you just start dropping blood droplets all over uh, Piltover. He'll rip through the- Oh my gosh. A common, first of all, he, he ripped through the army. A common civilian just walking down the street? Forget it. Cat food. Forget it. Bro, so that- this may be food. this this may be expands the potential of of her army hoping that that thing follows her instructions or that the doctor has the same intentions as she does. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm sure the doctor doesn't want to destroy the underground. I mean, that's, he's been there for as long as we can remember. You know, since we met him. So I mean, it's a slippery slope with Arcane. You know. Another incredible episode of Arcane, and we can't wait to get on to our next one. Thank y'all for joining us for the latest episode of Arcane. Let us know what you thought about the latest episode down in our comments, and be sure to go over to our Patreon to check out our full-length uncut reaction, or you can stop by simply to support our channel. And I'm Dre, the Beauty in the Beard. We're signing off until the next one. Mm -hmm.